Hello. You may have already seen a couple of videos we've got out there on the uh, the new multiple sparking system from AccuSpark that we're hoping to launch later on in the summer. Uh, we're just going to do a quick video now just to show you uh, what that looks like on an oscilloscope. So let me just show you what we're looking at. So we've got two lines, the blue line and the red line. The red line is amp draw um, and that's the, the coil. So the coil you can see drawing current, charging up and then it reaches saturation point, it can't take any more and then it's triggered from the distributor and then that releases the charge, creates a spark um, and then it'll move along the blue line and then it'll go to the next one. Uh, if I increase the speed, because the screen is a fixed period of time, you'll get more sparks in obviously the same period of time. So as I increase the speed, you'll get more sparks. Okay, so up to two, three, four thousand RPM. Come back down again. Let's bring it right down to cranking speed. Okay, so we get right down 250 RPM. That's cranking speed. So now we're going to engage multiple spark system. So we're going to engage it now. So now we're getting five sparks for every one that we were getting before. Now, if that doesn't start your car, nothing will. Um, as I increase the speed, let's say that just goes up slowly, we're going to, the car sort of starting and it doesn't really require the five. Now it drops down to three, but it's a, this is a fast tick over. We start to accelerate, we're getting up to 1,000, 2,000, it's now dropping off to two sparks and as we get up higher into the rev range it's going to just drop down to a single spark that's all that's required now i mean really you only need the multiple sparks at the sort of the lower the lower rpms come back down you'll see it come back it's only jumps to two then as it comes down it will show three there you go and then that's uh well, now we're sort of below tick over. We're sort of at two or 300 RPM now, so your car wouldn't be running now anyhow. So if we bring it back up to tick over. So at tick over, you're going to get sort of three. So it should, it should give you a nice smooth tick over um, and a, a massive improvement on, uh, on starting and running. Thank you.